Hi guys, Kai here and welcome back. This is episode 162 of the FIFA 17 My Player Career. Now it has been a week since I last uploaded on this series, uh, so I do apologise for that, but I've had a few personal things come up uh, during the week, so it all should be sorted by now. Uh, so we should be back to a normal daily routine for this series, barring Sundays and Mondays, of course. I don't normally upload my play on the Sundays and Mondays, but we will have other stuff coming. Remember, we have the return of Match Day uh, Live series as well. We already did Episode 1 with Arsenal and Chelsea in the Community Shield last weekend, which Arsenal actually went out and won, which is fantastic. First trophy of the new season went to Arsenal. And then, of course, an hour ago... Um, before this one went up at 4, I think this one is going up at, uh, an hour ago at 3pm UK time, uh, the first Premier League episode of the Match Day Live episode went live as well. So hopefully Arsenal can get three points later tonight, taking on Leicester City and have a great start to the Premier League season. But we're not concentrating on all that right now. It is the My Players series. We are with Bayern Munich. And we are trying to get ourselves to become the German champions yet again. We're still in the Champions League, remember. And I think we do play the second leg in today's episode, which is against Juventus. And one of our former clubs, of course. We had an absolutely fantastic time over in Italy with Juve. And so it will be um, a bit of a shame that we have to knock them out if we do actually go out and knock them out. I think we've got a pretty decent first leg result. So... Fingers crossed we can get the job done, get ourselves into the quarterfinals of the Champions League and then hopefully we can go all the way into the final. Yeah, but we do have a one goal lead in this game, we've got 10 minutes to play in the first half. Kai's already picked up a yellow card so he's got to be careful for the rest of the match. And here he is, takes on the shot and straight into the hands of the goalkeeper who holds on to it pretty easily there. Is that going to push us off into the second half? I think it might do unless we've got time for another chance which we don't. So into the second half we'll go, Kai's coming on a 7.3 rating, 5 minutes played in the second period. Bayern are going straight through the middle here, here is Kingsley Common now for Bayern Munich, played inside for Kaku, now Kai, nice little bit of skill there from Kai, opens up the pass for Kaku again, now Dorsch, nice little 1-2, Dorsch with a little bit of a gap, he takes a shot off and that is his second goal of the game. Less than 10 minutes played in the second period, it's now Bayern Munich 2, Hoffenheim 0. And I think that he's going to shore up the three points now for Bayern. And as I always say, a step closer to becoming the German champions yet again. Retaining that title, of course. Uh, but a good shot and good finish there from Dorsch. I think he did get the first goal as well. So two goals in the game for Dorsch. Can he grab himself a hat-trick? Still plenty of time to do so, if he can. Well, that is his second league goal of the season. And they both come in the same game. So just over an hour gone then, Hoffenheim have themselves a corner which is headed away, not too far though, and the chance didn't come in to get it back into the area, thankfully now a counter attack is on here for Kai and Bayern Munich, he's got past that last defender, can he get past the goalkeeper as well, he cuts it back, the shot comes in, and good save there from the goalkeeper, should have placed that one into that far corner really, uh, but the goalkeeper did do well, and a 7.7 .7 rating for Kai as he takes off that shot. Well, lucky. at least he got that one on target. It was a tricky one, a tricky effort there from Kai, but we're still leading by two goals to nil. Into the final 20 minutes then of this match. Here is Kai again, just losing out. And now Hoffenheim have a chance to pull a goal back here. A great visual play here. And he's going through. He's got one defender in front of him. He cuts inside, takes a shot off. Goalkeeper Leno makes a save, and it goes out of play for a Hoffenheim corner. So good counter-attacking play there from Hoffenheim. Looking a little bit dangerous now into the final 15 minutes. Uh, cross comes in. Get it away. Somebody get it away. The goalkeeper punches it away. And that leaves the goal wide open for Hoffenheim to tap it in. And they've pulled a goal back. Just over 10 minutes remaining. Bayern Munich got to be careful here. Look at this terrible defending. No, we're not even going to see, see the real full replay. Uh, but it was terrible defending. The goalkeeper came out. Only could punch it a, a metre away from where he actually punched it from. And the goal was wide open. So by minute two, Hoffenheim won. We're into the final minute now. Just need to keep the ball up this end of the field. And it's Kai. Nice little ball through there for Boga. Uh, wide space. And he tried to play Kai in the middle. But goes out of play for a goal kick. And that goal kick's not going to even get the time to play. Because the final whistle blew. And a 7.6 final match rating there for Kai. Not a bad result. Uh, performance even for Kai. A good result for the squad. Three points in the bag. 
And as I promised, we do have Champions League action in today's episode. It is the return leg of the Bayern Munich versus Juventus game. We did win the first leg, so we have the away goal advantage as well. And let's see if we can just defend, try and keep ourselves a clean sheet. That will give us a good advantage. And hopefully we can get ourselves into the next round of the Champions League. We actually won 3-0 in the first leg. I totally forgot about that. Three goals to the good. And I can't see Juve scoring four without us even scoring one, can you? That's what they're going to need to do if they're going to be progressing through to the next round. Scoring four at the Allianz Arena, pretty unheard of to be fair. So I think we can safely say that we are already through to the next round of the Champions League. Uh, they're all going to be big clubs now as well, of course, no matter who we face. They've done fantastically well to get this far. And remember, we did used to play for Juventus. We had a great time there. And so we'll be ashamed for knocking them out of the Champions League. But you've got to do what you've got to do for your, for, uh, for your current club. And let's see if we can get Kai on that score sheet. Here is Kaku, plays the ball forward. Musonda, Kai's just hovering around there, just outside the 18-yard box, holding up play well, sees a little bit of a gap, plays it in, shot comes in from Kaku, goalkeeper makes a great save, and it goes out of play for a German um, corner kick. Corner comes in from Musonda, headed away, back out there to Musonda, can he get another cross in? He does again, not past the defenders, and headed away for another throw. So into the final 10 minutes now, it's still Bayern Munich who have that three goal aggregate lead. Still 0-0 on the night though, which is a bit of a shame. That ball gets played there into the near post, but nobody fast enough to attack it. Kai's had a pretty quiet game. He's only on a 6.9 rating, so that is a bit of a shame. Uh, but here he is now in possession, plays a nice ball through, carries on his run. Kingley Common finds him and Kai passes it past the goalkeeper into the back of the net. And finally the deadlock has been broken. That bumps up the aggregate score to four goals to nil now for Bayern. And of course that means we are be going through to the next round. Good play there from Bayern Munich. Quite surprised it took so long uh, to finally get that goal. But Juve have defended pretty well. Bayern Munich. Failed our guest to be creative going forward in today's match, but we did finally get that goal. And now we're pushing for a second here. Are we going to get a second? Here's Boga. Here's Kaku. Finds Kai on the edge of the area. Plays it through. Shot comes in. A nice one-handed save there from the Juve goalkeeper. And Juve, since conceding that goal, they've just fallen asleep. Fortunately for them, though, the goalkeeper hasn't. Kraken saved that. They had to play for a corner kick. And surely this is going to be the last action of this match and of this tie. Maybe another chance in. No, the goalkeeper, sorry, the referee blows the final whistle. We win 1-0 on the night, 4-0 on aggregate. Kai finishing the game with an 8.4 rating, but as we know, before he even scored that goal, he was down in a 6.9, I think it was. And so not the best of games until he actually got that goal, but there is confirmation of Bayern Munich knocking out Juve to get themselves into the quarterfinals of the Champions League.